Hello everyone, it's me and Ela here, not in a video game ad, but in a real video. We just wanted to make a quick update video to explain what's going on with us, where we've been, what are our plans for this channel, and to clarify a couple of things, because uh, we have disappeared for the past several months, and I wanna tell you guys what's been going on. In short, I think the past three months and the past year, Shredder, come on. Shredder really wants to be part of this video. He's feeling very left out. Everyone's like, oh, bring the dog in. Yeah. That'll make it more emotional. He's here, jumping at my side, all right? Oh my God. Can you still be mad at us? Can you still be mad at us over the video game? Look at that face and tell me you're still mad at us about that video game. The past three months and specifically the past year has probably been the hardest of our lives. It's just been a string of really difficult to handle events that I think really just took a toll on us. From my part, I was just feeling like I literally could not make any more videos. Mm -hmm. I just hit a wall where it was, it was gotten so bad that it was basically either stop making videos or disappear forever. I just have accepted that I am like, actually depressed and so confronting that was hard because i always felt like it was like a weakness or something and it's hard to admit to yourself that you're actually depressed i've always thought knew that i had problems with anxiety but that's almost like romantic like ooh, mm -hmm. he's an anxious artist oh shit, <laughs> that's interesting i wonder what he's anxious about but depression is just like sad it feels like sad and pathetic. And you don't want to confront that. So I was like, I got to take three months off and I've got to change everything. I have to fundamentally do all the changes I need to to get myself better because I can't make videos for you guys. I can't do anything. I can barely function. And during that period, Hila's dad also lost the battle with cancer. And she was gone in Israel for a long time, and I was here alone, and that was very difficult for both of us. And um, it's just, it's been a really, it's been a really hard year. And um, I feel like I've been a, in a black hole. I mean, you know, I just feel like I've been in a black hole. I almost don't even remember things. I just want to explain the video game thing was just, really bad timing first of all i mean here's this tweet when we were looking for developers in february of last year and they've been working on it since then you know and when they finally were like hey it's ready to launch this is our release date it's unfortunate that it happened during our break but i almost i wasn't ready to come back and start making videos and i just i really didn't want to screw them over yeah there's a whole company who's worked on it yeah know? so it's not just up to us. Anyway, I definitely understand why you guys were upset that we disappear and then throw this ad in your face. I wasn't thinking about it like an ad. I thought it was just like a fun kind of nostalgic video game. But you guys are definitely right that that was ridiculous. I should, I should have not. I should have known that that's what would yeah. have caused it. I could have delayed the game until we were making... Or, more videos i don't know or some people said we should have at least made an update video before yeah, yeah. which is also not a bad idea but yeah we we're just not there anymore. i don't know yeah I, I that's part of my problem is that i feel like i i don't even know what's what anymore i don't know i just i don't know anyway the video game thing was just another string of very poor judgment on my part which is part of the reason why i took the break because i was just like what is going on i cannot think but hopefully to those of you that stick around, we will make some classic goofs for you to enjoy. And you'll be like, hey, I remember why I enjoy watching these guys again. I saw one comment that was, hey, it's that guy from the podcast. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Okay, uh, f good point. Um, the podcast was never meant to replace our videos here. It's just that we weren't posting and we didn't want to disappear. So that's why we've been so active on the podcast channel. And in a way, it gave us some stability. Yeah. In a time that everything wasn't. Yeah, I, I didn't want to just disappear order. off the face of the planet, you know. I mean, it, it's a compliment. People want videos, right? I yeah. mean, <laughs> I, I, I have to tell you guys, when, when like the audience turns on, on you, 
it, it, it is such an awful feeling. I want you to know how badly I felt from the video game thing. Like, I mean, I can't express how awful it feels, okay? But on the other hand, I understand that, you know, you guys, you guys want videos. And, and I want to make videos for you guys, too. And so it is nice to know that you guys <laughs> care, in a sense, to make me feel so awful. It's my fault, but you care to make me feel so awful. So thank you. If you need to bounce, I completely understand. And if you want to stick around, well, you are going to see our next video is going to be a basically a review of all of the Jake and Logan Paul videos we've missed today. No, I'm kidding. We found this. Uh, we found a talking AI vape. OK, so you are not going to want to miss this world premiere. <laughs> Which is gonna be our next video. Hello, iJoy. Shut down. Ooh! <laughs> Talking AI vape. Trust me, guys. The world will never be the same again. So, uh, in summary, I am a giant turd sandwich. That's how I feel, so, you know, make no mistake about it. I mean, you know, we're all on the same page. <laughs> You see me as a giant turd sandwich. I feel like a giant turd sandwich. What am I in the sandwich? Dude, you're like, you know what you are? Piece of lettuce, like you're, this. you're, you're the umbrella toothpick that goes <laughs> in the sandwich. You've writ, you've stayed above the shit sandwich. You've, sh you've given shade to the shit sandwich. I do look like a toothpick. Exactly. I'm telling you, you're, you're, you've risen above. So guys, if you want to take a bite of this shit sandwich then I urge you to stay tuned because it may smell like shit and it may look like shit and I can guarantee you it's gonna taste like shit and you're gonna love it when you have a bite of this. Guys, thanks for watching and we will be seeing you very, very soon in our new video in about six months. <laughs> Just kidding, next week. Thanks for watching guys and uh, appreciate you very much.